Hi everyone and welcome back to the Class 47 Peter YouTube channel and in today's video it's going to be about the Hornby Southeastern and Chatham Railway H-Class. I've done a review on this model in the past and it's featured in many of my running session videos but unfortunately rather lately this model came down with a bit of trouble. As it says in the title this model has come back into service after motor repairs because unfortunately this model has come down with some motor trouble because this, mo this model had a dodgy motor now when I first got this model there was nothing wrong with it it was perfect I do understand that from around that time when the model first came out there were problems I had heard of with the pickups and some quality control issues. My model hasn't had any of those problems but it is quite unfortunate that down the line that this model should have a motor issue. On a couple of occasions when I've been doing running session videos whilst filming the ha I have seen smoke from the motor when the model is stored with wheel slip and that that's something I've not seen before because I've seen wheel slip on other models and there's never been any smoke coming from the motor so that shouldn't really happen not with a good model well not with a good motor it shouldn't anyway at least but also something else I noticed was the smell that this motor was giving off and the smell I can only describe as being very similar to the smell that the motors in the Triang models give off so what I'll do is, on a few occasions, every so often, I would take the model out of the cupboard where it's kept in and just give it a small test run, just to make sure that the motor was still working. However, when I came to do so one day, the model barely moved even an inch forwards and then the motor just was just smoking. It just stopped dead and the motor was just smoking basically so I took the model apart and it was then on it was clear that the motor had given up the ghost and had burnt out now originally my plan was to buy a new motor so I could fit the new motor with the help of my dad but I later learned that the motor was coming in from China and that would take a while to get here and so then I remembered Hornby's customer care service because they do repair models and so I got in touch with Hornby about this and so I sent the model off to Hornby and it's I don't think it's even been a week actually when today on the day I'm filming this video just before I went out to see Britannia in the Warsaw area hauling the William Shakespeare a courier turned up at the door with a parcel and when I got back after seeing Britannia I opened it up not expecting that this model was inside and it was only then when I noticed the Hornby box and as soon as I unwrapped the bubble wrap there was this model I wasn't expecting it to have been repaired this quickly but it has and so that has been a very swift repair job and also it was done free of charge so a big thumbs up to Hornby there for their customer care service because it really is brilliant. So here's the model out of the box and I just can't express enough just how happy I am to have this model back in the collection. I didn't expect the repairs to be carried out in the short time there were. I was expecting the repairs to have taken longer but again like I say that is brilliant customer care service from Hornby there so again thumbs up to them for that and I'm just so overjoyed to have the model 
back at home with the collection and to have her back in service and running order again. Okay, so now I am going to test the motor. And so the model is on the track. And so now this is the moment of truth. Oh yes, look at that. She works. And that's very smooth as well. So yeah, I'm well chuffed with that. <laughs> See what I did there? No, that was terrible. <laughs> It does make a noise when it's going in reverse, but I'm sure that will improve over time. But yeah, I am well happy with this. And so, she's back in service. So, thank you ever so much, Hornby, for helping me get in there repaired. And so what I'm going to do for you all now is I'm going to film a little running session video with the H-Class. So thank you for watching this video. I know it's not been anything amazingly spectacular, but I just wanted to do a video on the H-Class back in service. And I wanted to do a video talking about the motor repairs that this, mod that this model had. So I hope you've enjoyed this video regardless, and I hope you enjoy the running session. So thanks for watching. Subscribe to the channel and check out all my other videos and I'll see you again soon. Until next time, stay safe and take care.